Hello Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all, what's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So... Whenever you do see this, it will be the right time. As always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. And if you're interested in a personal reading, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. Okay, so Sagittarius, you are being deeply replenished. Um, and some of you are retreating, resting. I'm seeing someone getting like a, a massage, deep tissue massage, but like taking a break after a long battle like i'm i'm picking up on something with the past five months past five months may have been really chaotic but this is a moment of like deep replenishment rest retreating and be held so i see you going maybe back and forth with like s some judgment ready to make a judgment some of you have been like going back and forth judging a situation that you've been in and interesting it's like with this um judgment and like this person is about to call out a winner with the trophy five of wands is like everybody wanting like a lipstick everybody wanting and it's like different people wanting you i'm seeing as like either like different offers different people especially with this knight of pentacles um in surrounding you someone who is like wanting to um pursue something with you for a long period of time and you may have been going back and forth with with like what is best suited for you what is best suited for you and being able to, to choose. Wow. So I see you as like being able to choose what it is or who you are allowing to be in, in your life here. And I see you as like taking a break from what you've been working on. And giving your time or your focus to something else now, which can be that deep replenishment, um, that rest, that like rest after a struggle, after a fight, healing, knight of pentacles, um, okay, and king of pentacles. So someone who is real serious, who I'm seeing like someone in, in business or is very financially stable here. This is someone who moves slow but is trustworthy in your surrounding you. Seven of Cups. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You got you got options. Multiple options. And you're and this may come they this may come after a time of like feeling like you didn't have any. But things are about to move very quickly and I see something as like speeding up an offer. I'm seeing yes, just say, just say yes. Um, and it's funny because this guy is like holding a rose, like someone's like, just say yes, just take the rose, just take it, just, just take what I'm, just take what I'm giving you. <laughs> um, I do see also financially like someone wanting to give you something financially, support you, um, or invest into you financially. And I'm seeing like a yes, like, okay, I'm going to say yes to this. Moving forward with it. But also, 
strategizing. I'm seeing tunnel vision. You being very tunnel vision. It's like only seeing one thing, not really seeing anything else surrounding you, but it's like you're you're seeing one thing right now and like this if like that's what you want, it's like th that's what you're going to get. Taking a risk, taking a chance towards something and and like it's like this is what I want and this is what I'm going to like I, if there's a will, there's a way. Literally said chairs right now it's like if there's a will there's a way and you're making it you're making it happen figuring it out it's like i'm gonna i'll figure it out leave the rest up to me i'll figure it out oh four wands invitation to come together um something is coming together you're coming together with someone an invitation where someone's saying yes okay four of swords reversed is like okay you're in that deep replenishment and now there's a there's this time and moment of coming out of it also getting ready for the action again who is this hierophant surrounding uh sagittarius there is someone who I see you viewing as a uh, hmm, like waiting, waiting. There could be like a few people waiting on you. Okay, someone needing to make a, a decision. Interesting. <laughs> okay, so you got someone here who you're seeing as like. Uh, needing to make a choice, needing to make a decision, and it also looks like they're waiting for something. And it could be that invitation or an offer. So you may be kind of going also back and forth with like, should I take a risk and, and like invite this person somewhere? So let's take a look at this person. Um, King of Pentacles surrounding you with masculine energy doesn't have to be someone who is um in their masculine energy right now king of pentacles is like very business minded oh especially with that king of swords someone who works a lot and the high priestess someone who is also very intuitive who is um not saying too much about something High Priestess is like the actions is like something that they're they're keeping a secret but they're wanting to have open and honesty so it's like them wanting to reveal something to you at the right time hmm someone's waiting for the right time to reveal something to you right now they're seeing you as maybe being very uh, busy or like having other responsibilities here. But also maybe releasing it. King of Cups. They're, they are seeing you as someone who's like ready. Ready for something serious. Where are you being called to journey to? So someone is maybe thinking about taking, making a journey towards you or there's some sort of like distance here. Clarify the high priestess as the actions towards Sagittarius. Nine of Cups. So definitely keeping how, how they're feeling uh, a secret for the moment but they're positive with the nine of cups it's looking like positive feelings actions is like they want to they want to get to a place where things are good things are where there's just happiness four of wands a secret invitation hmm <laughs> okay Secret invitation, and I'm seeing a I'm seeing a home over here. You could be getting a secret invitation to someone's like home. 
Interesting. That, that just got interesting. So you are being initiated. The initiation, rite of passage, crossing the threshold, Sagittarius. You are crossing the threshold. It's like you've been in this dark place, but there is this opening and you're being initiated and crossing this like, like you're going from one place to a new place. Some of you, like, I'm just seeing a huge change, transformation. Things are changing at a cellular level. Deep healing. You're being initiated to this, like, next level in your life. An opportunity that's going to level you up in a way. Tell me about this initiation for Sagittarius. Three of Wands. It, it's it's coming in. That's what they're saying. It's coming in. Three of Wands. This is something maybe you've been waiting for. Waiting for some sort of initiation. Uh, next level promotion. Knight of Swords. Okay, that's very quick energy very fast so very soon very soon is what they're saying there is going to be a very serious conversation about it okay that may catch you off guard clarity okay wow you are going to be like going through this initiation process which you are going to cross this like point in your life of like getting over fears okay so things might get scary at first and it's part of the initiation but it's some it's something that you can handle and it's something that you will overcome you'll overcome it and on the opposite side come out even stronger even better even um like up upgrades in like so many different areas of your life because of this healing process and a lot of this healing process is like your own fears so you facing your own fears there's a huge transformation on a cellular level deep healing i was literally feeling it physically um on the left side of my belly so some of you may feel that feel it on the left side it's literally like on a cellular level on a physical level healing and it's like a lot of it is also mental it's a very mental healing that you're going through here where you are literally overcoming uh fears fears of like being stuck fears of attachments fears of like um i'm even hearing like commitments i'm hearing fearless so coming out of this fearless because you're you've you're facing all your fears you've you've you're literally going through that process of like facing your fears, facing the darkness, facing maybe the darkness within, the shadow side within. Traumas. Traumas are fears that we haven't dealt with, that we haven't overcome. And bringing certain levels of like stress into our life from that trauma is like something that helps you overcome those fears. Like for example, uh, relationships. You may have certain fears with like relationships or being hurt in a relationship because of a past relationship where you felt like you were deeply hurt and there's all these fears with future relationships. But you, now you, you get into a situation where you are building healthy relationships and there's these fears 
uh, because you are in a relationship or moving towards a relationship. But the difference is, is that it's being built off something that is um, being built off a healthy foundation. That's just an example, but you are literally being initiated to the next level of your life. I believe in you. You can do this. You will overcome it. You will overcome it. Okay. A lot of reflecting on yourself, the ego too, but also a lot of clarity that's coming in, a lot of communication, clear communication, transformation. Is there anything else, Sagittarius? Okay. Longing for home, belonging, the original light workers. It's like you're coming to your home, to your sense of uh, like security. You could be moving towards a, a new home. Longing for home and belonging. Some of you have been like longing for a sense of belonging. And you're being initiated towards that. Wow. Seeing the number 10. 8. 15. Those numbers could be birthdays or special days. Seeing the letters D, E, M, R, I, S, F, N. So those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know if you made it this far in the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.